Snowdrop to air the next three episodes for three consecutive days. Following the controversy over alleged historical distortion, JTBC Snowdrop decided to create a special broadcast schedule to ease viewers' concerns. In hopes of resolving misunderstandings originating from the beginning of the drama, JTBC will air episodes 3, 4, and 5 on December 24th, 25th, and 26th, respectively, at 10.30 p.m. KST. On December 23rd, JTBC released the following statement. The controversy continues for JTBC's Snowdrop. Due to the nature of the drama, all narratives cannot be released at once, so it seems that a misunderstanding has arisen from the initial development. In response, JTBC decided to specially air episodes ahead of schedule to ease viewers' concerns. Episodes 3 to 5 of Snowdrop, which will air for three days from December 24th to December 26th, will reveal the background story of Soo Ho, played by Young Hae In, a North Korean spy dispatched to South Korea, coming to Korea and the unfair power situation, which will explain the probability of the initial setting. In the drama, it will turn out that the Agency for National Security Planning is the organization that brings the spies to South Korea and the leaders of North Korea and South Korea will collude for power and money. In addition, the episodes will contain stories of young people who get caught up in their secret operations. JTBC respects various views and opinions about our content. In order to hear the opinions of viewers, we are listening to diverse voices by opening the portal site's real-time chat window and the official viewers message board. This special schedule was also decided in order to address viewers' concerns. We will continue to listen to your opinions and do our best to create good content. Four Girls Planet 999 contestants to debut together in New Girl Group. Four former contestants from Girls Planet 999 will be debuting together in a brand new girl group. On December 24th, FC Entertainment officially announced that Kishida Ririka, Chang Ching, Li Yunji, and Hayashi Hana, all of whom competed together on the net audition program Girls Planet 999, would be debuting as members of their upcoming girl group. FC Entertainment's new girl group, which will consist of a total of six members, is scheduled to make their debut in early 2022. The agency stated, our six-member girl group including Kishida Ririka, Hayashi Hana, Chang Ching, and Lee Yun Ji will make their official debut in the first half of next year. Please show them a lot of love and interest. Are you excited to see the four girls debut together? Han Ji Min shares thoughts on her upcoming movie A Year End Medley. In the pictorial, Han Ji-min delicately portrayed her character So Jin from her upcoming movie A Year End Medley. The film centers around the people who come to Hotel Amras, each with stories of their own, and build new relationships. The film boasts a star-studded cast including Han Ji-min, Lee Dong-wook, Kang Han Nol Girls Generations Yuna, Won Jin Ah, Seo Kang Jun, Lee Kwang Soo Kim Young Kwang, Do Sung Hee, Lee Jin Wook, Lee Kyu Hyung, Jo Jun Young, Won Ji In, Lee Hae Young, and Young Jin Young. Han Ji Min's character So Jin is a hotel manager who is told by a fortune teller that her Mr. Wright will confess his feelings before the year ends. In the interview after the photo shoot, Han Ji Min shared, A year-end medley is not just about love stories between men and women, but it also deals with precious hearts that care for each other. There will be more things to sympathize with because viewers will be able to meet stories of various emotions and not just one feeling. To sum it up, it's a romance restaurant. A year-end medley will premiere on December 29th in theaters and through Ting. What are your thoughts for this news? Share your thoughts with K-pop Radar on the comment section. And by the way, I'm really sorry if I pronounced name or title wrong. I hope you enjoyed the video.